Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Alyssa. If you're new here, hi, what's up? Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to join our babies. Um, if you guys want to see how I got this look and how I did my hair, please stay tuned. More videos are coming out soon. Yeah, love you guys. <laughs> when I first get ready, I start with moisturizing my face and my lips. So I'm going to use the Vaseline. I lost my other one, but... I guess it is what it is. I'm gonna have to like mute the background because I don't think I can have my music playing. But to moisturize my face, I'm gonna be using the Neutrogena Bright Boost Gel Cream. I really like this. And it smells really good. I got a cold I figured while I'm getting ready, I might as well show you guys the whole thing on how I curl my hair too because I'm going to be doing my hair. So I figured I might as well just record and show you guys how I do my hair. After I moisturize my face, I do my eyebrows and I've been filling them in with powder. Well, my eyeshadow from this palette. This is the Pure Suray Diaries. I think that's how you say it. But it comes with like a whole bunch of cute shades. But I've been using this one for my brows. And I really like the way it looks. So we're going to do it again. But yeah, I'm going to just take my little spoolie and start filling my brows in. I want to show you guys how I do it. I use really light strokes first. And then we just gonna blend everything in. I like doing my brows with powder, like eyeshadow, but powder mostly. I didn't realize how much I would like it more than pencils and dip brows. I feel like it's easier to work with and it's so much easier to blend. If I would have known this a long time ago, life would have been so much easier. <laughs> After we do our eyebrows, we're gonna conceal them with the Born This Way concealer. I use the one in Nude. And I just put some of it on the back of my hand. This little brush, it's a Luxie Precision Crease Brush in 246. But I use it for my eyebrows. <laughs> we're just gonna conceal the bottom and the top and fix as we need. We'll fill as we need. <laughs> I'm looking at so many different mirrors right now. But we could seal them and blend it. And then do the other one and we'll fix them when we're done like if we need to add more brow we will I blend a lot with my fingers but I feel like it just gets it all then we're gonna conceal the top of your brows. Well, my brows, not yours. Okay. 
my face gets so white because of my lights in here and I don't know how to fix it. It happens in my videos sometimes too and it's so annoying. Or like when I go live on Instagram. I literally have filmed one other tutorial already like on my everyday makeup but I didn't like it. That's the problem with me when I film for like you guys. I have such a hard time posting them and because I always find something that I don't like about it. So then I have to go <laughs> and film a whole nother one because I didn't like that last one that I filmed. So here I am filming another one for you guys. But I'm just taking a little bit more of my uh, powder and I'm just going to fill in the spots that got a little covered with the concealer. Now that we got both brows on, they look not that bad, but we're going to lighten them a little bit because they're a little dark, but there is like a blank spot right there and that's not acceptable. Whatever product I have left on my hand, I will just use it and conceal my eyes while I'm here. I'm just going to keep this right here. So y'all could see, and I could see. I feel like I sneeze. Yep, yep, yep. Mm. Once my lids are concealed, I will prime my face and I'm gonna be using where did it go I'm just gonna be using my Tatcha primer I got a little mini one and I'm going to I wonder if I and I'm just gonna put it in my spots where I have pores, bad pores. And I really have them on my nose and I try to get a little bit of my acne scars. If you guys know how to get rid of scars, please let me know in the comments because I got them bad. <laughs> no, they're not that bad, but I just want them gone. Ever since I got off of, um, Accutane, my skin's been really clear. I've just had, I've just been stuck with my spots and my scars. After I prime my face, I will take my foundation, which I've been using the Fenty one again. And I don't know why I stopped using the Fenty one because I love it. And it works so good. I love Fenty stuff. Okay, and then I just put some of it on the back of my hand. And I take a big brush, like, this is a Morphe Y6, she needs to be clean. And I just pat this all over my face. I'll blend a little bit, but most, after I get most of it on my face, I'll take my beauty blender and get it all blended. My ears. <laughs> my hair looks so crazy. I hate having foundation on my lips. I hate it so much. And 
then I take my big beauty blender and I just pat it all in. I really want to start filming in like a different spot because I don't like the way this looks. I wish I should just buy a backdrop. That's what I should do. So I could be professional. <laughs> Me trying to be the best I can be to give the best content. She'll get there. Well, I'll get there. I don't know why I keep saying she. I will get there eventually. But right now, little steps. And I just messed up this brow. Whatever's left on my hand, I'll just take it and put it in spots that weren't covered as well. Like this spot right here. My spots are just really bad right there. Now that we're done blending, I take my Fit Me Concealer in Ivory. I've used a lot of it actually, it's almost gone. And I will do my concealer underneath my eyes. I really like having bright under eyes, so you guys don't have to use this lightest shade, but I like to use the lightest one because I like the brightness. It makes me look more awake. <laughs> and I'll do like my chin, my cupid's bow, down my nose, and up where my brows and stuff are. And I will take my beauty blender and just blend it all in. I have like a I don't know what it is. Sometimes it like goes in right there like and in... I don't know. I don't know. I've been sneezing so much lately. I hope it's just allergies. I'm not trying to get sick. blended all of our concealer and our foundation I take my Fenty powder in banana this is such a good oh I'm spilling it this is such a good powder and it smells really good I'll just take some of it out of the top and I will set my under eyes It smells so good. I literally can sit here and smell it. That's so weird, but I love it. Then I'll go over my eyes. And a little bit. I'll go over my eyebrows too with it. Like whatever's left on the back of the beauty blender. I'll use it and just touch my brows. Okay. And now that we're done doing that, we're going to take my MAC powder in NW22 and just kind of set the rest of my face. But whatever I want brighter, I make sure I use this powder because it's really it really brightens your face. I'm pretty sure this is the brightening one too. I think banana is the for anyone. I think that's what I read. Okay. And then we are going to take the Fenty. <laughs> I look crazy. We're going to take the Fenty Beauty um, bronzer and island, island team and contour our face. Why can't I open this? There it goes. 
I'm gonna take a Y9 Morphe brush and Ah, no, my nose is gonna run. I feel it. Can I get right here? Okay, once I do that, I'm gonna take my powder. Once we're done contouring and bronzing, I just take some of the powder on the back of my beauty blender again and clean up my contour, bronzer, whatever. I don't even know what to call it anymore. Oh, I just got it all up in my hair. Oh, well. My acne scars are a lot worse on this side than they are this side. It's so annoying. Okay. And then I'm going to take a... Like one of these brushes, just like the end of this, to contour my nose. And I'm just going to use the same bronzer that I used for my nose. And I just draw... A line up my bridge of my nose and I like blend it up to my brow right there I do the same thing for the other side me making my nose perfect how I, how I really want it to be <laughs> honestly if you guys could get a nose job would you get a nose job like if I had the money for it honestly I might do it <laughs> and then I take my brush that I use to blend my do my cheeks and my forehead and I just blend the crap out of the side of my nose <laughs> I sit here for so long just doing this this is probably where all my time goes when I get ready like I do everything else so fast but my nose mm -mm, I'll sit here like this and blend until she is right. I went to Mod and it was so yummy. I think I'm getting sick. And I just do it for both sides of my nose. And I do it underneath. I don't think I could be singing like this in my video. And then I do like a little button right here to make my nose look like a button nose. <laughs> I really am the worst. I blend the sides of my nose. <laughs> wow. Me making my nose to be exactly how the doctor should make it. And then once I actually blend everything, I take my beauty blender and I'll use the pointy side. And take a little bit and put it on the tip of my nose. And then I'll go up the bridge. And when you look like this. Do I have powder on my eye? When you look like this, this is when it gets real. 
I'm just kidding. Oh, she getting Dale? Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. <laughs> but I use this for everything, I swear. This is like the main thing that's always on my face. So once I'm done with my nose, I will take my... Oh, not again. I will take my bronzer or contour, whatever. Is this wet? <gasps> I had to touch my drink. Oh, I suck. Now I got a little bit wet in here. But I'll take my Morphe M441 brush and I'll just take some of this and just put it all over my lid. I focus mainly on browns on my lids. I don't really add any other colors. That's really what's always on my eyelid is brown. And I blend this. When I'm done with my lids, I take my palette, the Soyer, whatever, diary one, you know which one. And I take the darkest shade, well, like the one that I use for my brows, and I put it on my the top of my lash line. And I kind of wing it out a little bit. I really want to have a professional makeup artist do my makeup so bad. Like the guy that does Sophia Jamora's makeup, I don't know who he is. But he does her makeup so good and I love her. Let me just wing it out a little bit. And blend. I just poked myself in the eye. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, I didn't tell you. This is a BMX 498 line brush. I don't know where this came from. It says RNL Moda Pro. I think it came in my boxy charms, to be honest with you. Okay. Won't you look like a crackhead? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna add more brown, I think, to my lids. I have a Christmas party to go to tonight. I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. Like at all. Now that I'm done with all of this, I'm gonna take my clear brow gel from Anastasia. And just... all of this now we're gonna put lashes on I use Lily lashes in Miami I have to take the glue off of these ones I love these lashes I've worn these so many times I'm so surprised that they're still wearable if you guys wear falsies, comment down below what falsies you wear because I want to try new ones. And I'm really, like I love my Lily Lashes, but I really want to try other ones too. Just so I can get an idea. What if I fall in love with another pair of lashes? We're going to put this lash on first. I have to cover this. I don't know what is going on right there. But we're just going to set this on my eye. And take. Told y'all lashes take me from bitch to bitch. And we just have to put them in the right place. Also, if you live in Arizona and you know somebody that can do lashes that'll look like my falsies, please DM me on Instagram. Or comment below. 
because I would love to just go get extensions actually. Make my life so much easier. If I could find somebody to do extensions, I would look like this. I like the fluffy look. So if you know somebody that can do fluffy lashes, let me know. I'd very, 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 very much appreciate it. Okay, now we're gonna do my left eye. Sometimes I wanna take my nose ring out. Okay, now we're just gonna set you. I still don't know what I'm wearing tonight. Ugh. I suck, I suck, I suck, I suck. We're gonna put more dark down here, like on my lower lash line, just to darken the eyes a little bit more. literally right on top of the lash line okay now that our lashes are on and our lower lashes are covered we're gonna take this Hen Hank and Henry blickety black long wear liquid eyeliner and it looks like this my hands have so tanner on them but it looks like this and I do my inner corners like wings Okay, now we're just gonna put mascara on, which I used the Rocket Maybelline one, like it's all coming off. And I'll just blend my lashes in with the falsies. For blush, I'm gonna take the NYX Double Dare one. This one's really bright. I can open it. Now I'm just gonna take a little bit of my brush and do the side of my cheeks. A little bit more on the front, right here, and just blend it out. On my nose. Then we're gonna take my your well my Morphe setting spray uh, and just pat everything in with my beauty blender, even my powder from baking. Down here. Okay. Okay, next we're gonna highlight our face with the Physician's Formula in Champagne. And I take it on like a little brush like this. This is the Kylie one. And I'll do my nose. Down the bridge of my nose. My inner corners. Underneath my brows, then I'm gonna take a Morphe MB44 brush and do my cheeks. My lips, I forgot. Okay, I take my lip liner in London, it looks like this, and I line.
see what this color. Once I line my lips, I take my uh, concealer brush and I clean them up. Because sometimes my hand don't be so steady. I be freaking going crazy. Okay. Okay, now we're going to do our hair. I do like big, bigger waves, like curls. Mostly focus on the ends of my hair. So I'm gonna use this big barreled um, Remington wand. I don't remember where I got it from. I got it a long time ago. I'm gonna use the Tresme Keratin Smooth. Um, what is this called? Paint protectant. Okay, while this heats up, we're gonna put on some gloss. I've been using the DC lemonade lip gloss i don't know where to get this i don't even know what brand it really is i got it in my boxy charm but i love it so much so if anybody knows where i can get another one of these please let me know <laughs> somebody commented on my one of my tiktok videos and said that this was a youtuber's line and i don't know how true that is but if it is girl i need to know where i can get another one because <laughs> i've used the crap out of this lip gloss okay so now that i put this one on I am gonna go get my other lip gloss that I use. After I use that lip gloss, I use this iconic London one in Love Struck. And I just put some of this on. It's just a lighter color. I like the way that these colors mix. And that's the glosses and stuff that I use. And now we are going to do our hair. Well, my hair. This is what my hair looks like now. And now she's going to be curly after this. So I'm going to start in the back, I think, yeah. I'm going to take kind of big pieces. Maybe like this big. And I'm just going to wrap it around. I fucking stupid. No. Ah, my drink. I spilled it. That's what one side of my head looks like right now. <sighs> I'm 
this is my look. That is also how I curl my hair, like this. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I enjoyed making it for you guys, and I can't wait to give you guys more videos. <laughs>